Hi guys, it's Ben here and it's been a very positive few days for Liverpool in their pursuit of Naby Keita and a report today suggests that Red Bull Leipzig now want to sell him. So as we all know, there's been lots of back and forth over the past few weeks regarding Cater. There's been bids made, bids rejected, new bids supposedly going in. All summer, Red Bull Leipzig have insisted that they will not be selling the Ghanaian, but it looks like their resistance has been broken, as Carve Solikol today said on Sky Sports News that they are expecting some progress on that particular transfer. Liverpool have flown to Hong Kong, but that hasn't slowed down their efforts to sign Cater. There's going to be a second bid. Cater has told Leipzig he wants to move, and the key line is that a £57 million offer has been rejected, but senior figures at Leipzig Leipzig now want to sell Cater. He also added that a bid from the Reds should be on its way this week. Now as far as I'm concerned, Carve Solikol is quite a reliable journalist. He does tweet a lot of things from Sky Lee and other sources, but he clearly states when he's tweeting something that he's understanding or whether it's just something that his colleagues in Italy are learning. So he does make it pretty clear and it looks like what he told Sky is stuff that he has been told. So for me, I think we can pretty much take that at face value. I think this continues to move in the right direction. However, Red Bull Leipzig coach Ralph Hazenhuttle continues to play down the speculation by insisting that Cater is happy at his current club. Now there's interest in a lot of the Red Bull Leipzig stars that drove them to the Champions League. Hazenhuttle says that those players are comfortable and looking forward to the new season. They know what they have at Red Bull Leipzig. He says it's not their purpose to let those players get their first offer. Former Norwegian footballer Jan Ag Fjortoft has also tweeted today saying that he doesn't think this deal will happen. He says he's been told that he won't leave now, but Keita does have a clause in his contract that will allow him to leave next summer for a certain fee. This obviously isn't in line with anything that we've been reading in the last few weeks. This was something that would have been believable four, six weeks ago, but I think it has kind of moved on from this. I'm not sure whether this is new information that he's been fed or whether it's just him digesting information that's quite old now, to be honest. I'm not too worried about what he's saying. He's not someone that I consider reputable, especially with transfers. I think he's got a few things wrong in recent years. I think he said that Drexa to Arsenal was pretty much there. There's been some other instances when he's just been way off the mark. I'm not too concerned about him. I do always like to look at the bookies odds, as I often mention in my videos, and I must say they have Drifted slightly, it's now 2 to 5 rather than 1 to 6 of Cater signs for Liverpool this summer. So it's still odds on, it's still more likely that he joins than he doesn't, but they're not so confident on it as they were 24 hours ago, apparently, that this deal will get done this year. One deal that will get done this year, though, and looks like it's going to happen very soon, is Andrew Robertson from Hull, the left back, has left his club's pre season tour in Portugal. No reason given as to why by BBC's David Burns, but you can only assume that this is to go to Liverpool to complete his move. El Mohamed has also left that camp and he's said to be off to Villa, so it looks like, you know, if you had two and two together, these two are both leaving Hull City, with Robertson set to join Liverpool and replace Alberto Moreno. Leave a comment with when you think Naby Keita will be announced as a Liverpool player, or if you think he will. Do you think it will be in the next week, two weeks? Do you think it'll be do you think this one's going to go right down to the wire? Let me know down below. Hope you enjoyed the video, guys. Please do subscribe to my channel for all this sort of stuff. And drop a like if you're enjoying these regular transfer updates. Share the video for me too. Spread the word out. Follow my other socials, if they might say, on Twitter, Instagram, Snapchat, and Facebook. And I'll see you next time.